Hey guys, it is me, Happy Sarikan. Welcome back to Last and Earth Survival. So today is a beautiful day to do lots of raids in Last and Earth Survival. It's an always, it's an it's an always nice day to do more raids. So let's go to this base over here. And if you want to see other raids, make sure to check out the pinned comments, as there you can find the timestamps that will lead you to those other raids. So let's hop here and let's begin this live stream with our first raid of the day. So welcome to all those that have just joined. Glad to see all of you here. And also for those who do not know, the new event, the follow the Easter Bunny event is supposed to start on March 29th. Sadly, it's still not here yet. Today is not March 29th. So we'll have to wait until this event appears and then we'll be able to uh, begin our adventures but while we're waiting we can obviously do some more raids so i brought a bit maybe too many hatchets and i brought a c4 let's put that c4 in the chopper just so that i don't explode any unnecessary wor uh, wor worlds worlds <laughs> worlds just so that i don't explode any unnecessary walls i've done that in the past if you bring a c4 and uh, you don't want to drop that in your chopper you will make a mistake and you will waste that c4 it has happened to me pl plenty of times so be careful don't do that Leave your C4 in the chopper so that you accidentally don't place it on like a level 3 wall or something. Sometimes you'll run out of hatchets and you will just place it on a level 1 or on a level 2 wall. I think I've wasted 3 or 4 C4s like that. So it is definitely possible. And welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Glad to see all of you here. Hopefully you're having a great day. Welcome, welcome everybody. Today we're going to do a bunch of raids. That's the plan. Bunch of raids. And I also want to clear the transport up because I still haven't cleared it last time. Uh, we've unlocked... I've kind of started crafting a new drone mod. Some of you suggested that it's kind of nice, so I want to get that. But to get that drone mod, I need to get some more rotors. And we can get those rotors from the transport hub. So why not clear the transport hub as well? What is your favorite gun in LDOE? If I got a dollar, every time somebody asked me that question, I'd have maybe a few hundred dollars now. It's a Glock. I'd say it's a Glock. You don't really even need to modify it. It's a good weapon. It never misses. And it's quite common. It's very common. Why are you so late today? It's the new streaming time. That'll be my new streaming time. Uh, actually, I'm not sure if it'll be my new streaming time or not. I'm just late because I'm always late. It is what it is. But let's get a little bit of iron. Let's get some nails and let's dip out of this base. So does it get Psyx approval? Would you give this base Psyx approval? Kind of lame, I'd say. Yeah, kind of goop base. Let's not give it anything. We did get these ATV wheels that I can recycle. I don't even know why I'm getting them. As if I'll ever recycle them. But hey, let's grab that stuff. Let's go back to the base. And let's probably do some more tasks. And let's get ready to do another raid of the day. That'll be our second raid of the day. Alright, let's go back to the base. Also, the live stream isn't really that late. Yesterday's live stream was late. The past, like, three or four live streams were pretty late. Because they're getting to just later and later. Mercenary opening. Mercenary opening? Uh, some of the mercenaries are already at like kind of max level-ish. I need more contracts. And it's the settlement. I don't really grind and focus much on the settlement because it's not that interesting. But perhaps we'll do it. When are you going to play like a dog, says Roar? Today, at the end of the live stream, I think we're going to grind a little bit. A little bit in that supermarket simulator. Some of you enjoy that supermarket simulator. Myself, personally, I also enjoy that as well. So we're going to grind like a dog at the end of the live stream. But right now, we got more important things to do. Psych, even more important than the market simulator? Yes. Last day on Earth raids. So that's what we're going to do. Uh... What do we do? Where do I store nails? Okay, I probably store nails here. Let's drop the rest of the items up here. And I want to drop the iron inside of the warehouse. There we go. We did it. So everything sorted out. And while we are near this warehouse, I might as well get some pine planks. I might as well get a little bit of iron. And I want to hop to the settlement, even though I don't grind a lot in the settlement. I do like to hop in there and get more resources. That's the best way to progress in the settlement. Just getting lots of resources. Did the helicopter come to the game? Nope, helicopter is not in the game.
Uh, let's get more pine beams, ladies and gentlemen. You can never have enough pine beams. Are you gonna work like a dog today? Yep, you're the second person to ask that, yes. We're gonna work like a dog today at the end of the live stream. We're gonna grind some of that supermarket simulator. Hola, says Rudy Alejo is welcome. Welcome, hola, Rudy. Hopefully you're having a great day. Welcome to all those that have just joined. How many guns for port without event? For port without event? The port event doesn't really exist. It doesn't make the laboratory easier. It just gives you extra carbon composites and factory parts and you need a decent amount of weapons. Check out everything you need to know about LDOE and uh, or type on YouTube, Happy Cyric Laboratory and you'll get more information. Cyric Laboratory Guide. I have a live stream on that. We're gonna work like a dog today. That's the third person to ask that. Guys, are you trolling me? Or not? I'm just curious. Yes, we're gonna work like a dog today. Can't wait to be a dog. I was at the supermarket today and I, and I heard beep, beep, beep. Are you gonna work like a dog? Says so Yurichi, that's the fourth person. Guys, all right. Now you are trolling. Now I am sure you're just trolling me. That's all right. I forgive you. All of you, ladies and gentlemen, are forgiven. Thank you, Sire. Thank you. You're welcome. All of you are welcome. Okay, let's drop the gasoline. Let's drop some food. Okay, the fuel does not fit. Maybe I'm gonna just drop something in the chopper? Wait, how are we gonna work? In the supermarket simulator. We're gonna work like a dog today. It says Jesse Paquette. Yes, Jesse Paquette. We're gonna work like a dog today. A salmon one. This is Matthew. Welcome to the stream, Matthew. Glad to see you here. Let's pay the raiders now. And let's buckle up, buckaroos. How long are you gonna work like a dog today? I don't know, maybe for half an hour, we'll see. Do dogs work only for half an hour? I mean, you can still work like a dog for half an hour. Right? Doesn't have to be like a... You don't have to work day and night to work like a dog, I guess. I don't know, we'll see. There we go, the raiders are back. And what other tasks we need to do? We need to kill the blind one. Didn't I kill the blind one last time? We need to go quickly to the highway. I haven't been at the highway in a while, so let's go there. Every time I get a reason to visit some sort of a location that doesn't make a lot of sense, I do it because raiders want me to do it and I do it. So let's just go to the highway right now. Let's get one engine and let's go. We're gonna work like a dog today. Depends if you have doggo treats. Okay. Wait, if you have doggo treats, do you actually work like a dog? To work like a dog, you don't have to have any treats, I guess. In any case, let's get a few shotguns, a minigun. Uh, do the mods on the spear for raiders rep- Do the mods on the spear matter for raiders reputation, I guess? I don't think I can say it with certain, but I'm not certain, but I think it matters. That's it. Long story short, I think it does matter a bit. Let's heal up. Let's uh, get our guns. And Stacy F uh, Fegley? Stacy, thanks for... Uh, thanks for becoming a member. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for smashing the join button. Thanks for joining the... The Cyric Town. I'm the mayor. We don't have roads and... Public transport. That's it. That's how I welcome members. Maybe I'm scaring them away, but it is what it is. We need new developments for Last and Earth. I mean, we do need new updates. Are mods for spears worth it? Yes, they're very worth it. Let's go up here to the gas station. Are you strong because you're Cyric, or are you Cyric because you're strong, says Lin Ahmed. I never said I'm strong. I'm just Cyric because I'm Cyric. 
What do you think Last on Earth would be like if it was a first-person zombie survival game? It would be... Whoa! My mind just exploded just thinking about that. Thank you for... For, for giving this awesome, uh, unique idea that's never been said before. Last on Earth in first person. I mean, there are a lot of first person survival games already. Like, for example, Days Gone. I mean, Days Gone was a third person game. But it's the same. Uh, let's get the machete. Whoops. I mean, the closest game to Last on Earth survival in first person. I mean, there, there are some of them. I'd say Seven Days to Die kind. It's not the same completely. It's different. But it is a survival game. You get to raid. There's some sort of locations. There are zombies. So it's not like Seven Days to Die, probably, maybe. Um, there are probably other ones. There's Rust, except Rust is... is very hardcore, but Rust is also pretty cool. Love your videos for years. First live stream, though, says Stacy. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the first, first live stream. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Glad to see you here. Welcome, welcome. I attribute that to the later live stream because usually I live stream earlier. So now when I live stream a bit later, some of the people that have never been here, they can maybe visit for the first time because perhaps the time zones are better. I don't know. So I've never had this event here where I had to save this dude in this truck. Usually zombies were surrounding this guy here on this truck. Hmm. bench pressing a toddler today i don't even know why where that meme came from i don't remember but maybe we will bench press a toddler <laughs> we will be power lifting a toddler today bench pressing a toddler deadlifting a toddler Yo, Cyric, is it worth it to do arena if I'm level 91? It depends how many guns you have and what you want from that arena. If you have like 25 or something Glocks, then maybe it is worth it if you want blueprints and if you want your tactical backpack because from the arena event... Okay, this time I'm not going to get it because I have the silence packs, but if you don't have the silence packs and instead of the silence packs you have... Wait, I'm going to show you another box. If instead of the silence packs you have the special forces packs here you can have a chance to get the tactical backpack so if you want that tactical backpack a chance to get it then doing the arena is maybe worth it but if you don't need mods and you don't need that backpack a chance to get that backpack then maybe it's not worth it it's like shows his gratitude to his members by ignoring their comments so just know if he's not reading anything you say it is out of love says rudy i do try to read all of the comments I'm sorry if sometimes I miss a couple of comments. I apologies. Apologies, apologies. Excuse me? Uh, hello, Cyric. Our survivor needs a commuter bus and the message got retracted. Okay, just disappeared from the chat. Interesting. I was just about to read it and it disappeared. Hmm. Okay, we're done with this highway. Let's go back home. It's like, please tell me you will show us how you made the thumbnail with a very awkward short video. It says Flaming Fire. Uh, no? There's nothing to show? You see, he hates me. That's why he read that. Nah, he read that because he read that. Will you work on the garage? Why do I have to work on the garage? So we're doing lots of raids today. Yes, that's, that's the goal. That is the goal. Because we are waiting for the update. For the new event, not the update. We are waiting for this follow the Easter Bunny event. So that's it. I was at the store today and I got an Easter Bunny. Hell yeah. I got a chocolate bunny. Because why not? That's it. I thought it was worth it to share that info. 
Uh, the brain's not braining. We gotta talk to the raiders. Then the brain will brain a bit better. Um, we need to skip this. Do I kill the blind one or is Bunker Alpha not reset yet? I'm gonna quickly go outside just to check on Bunker Alpha. I don't think it's reset though. So I might have to skip the blind one. Yeah, we could reset the Bunker Alpha, but we'll see. Will he play more Rust? Uh, perhaps in the future, yes, I believe I will play more Rust. Any news on the new event that is coming? I don't think we have any new news. Everything is the same. Everything is same old. It's like, what is same old? No news. But I'm pretty sure we already know what that event is going to be about. It says that you can look for Easter eggs to claim rewards in the motel, lab, sewers, police station, bunkers, and etc, etc. So probably this will be something like a find the poster event. So you'll have to search. Instead of posters, you'll have to find the eggs. And uh, for getting those eggs, you'll be able to get rewards. That's about it. I think that'll be the event. Probably. But again, that's just my guess. To be quite honest with you, I'm more interested in the supply event more than the Easter one, says Pepe. Maybe. The supply event is supposed to have a vending machine, a carrot vending machine. So maybe you'll be able to get free carrots. Maybe we'll be able to store carrots there. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Now we have to open up a blue card. Is the PD reset? Uh, hopefully. And I don't have a lot of blue crates. So let's get this. Sorry, can you please help me? What happened? Let us know what happened. Us. Let's drop a little bit of iron. Find like 2,000 eggs or something. That would be brutal. It depends. What if you get 1,000 eggs per bunker alpha? Depends how many eggs you find. Cyric, is arena worth it? For a certain player, yes. I think it is worth it. To a certain player. Not everybody's going to find it worth it. But it is worth it. It's like I'm very poor. Guns, what do you recommend? Uh, check out everything you need to know about last generate. Link is down in the description. That video will get you started and it'll put you on the right track. What track is that? Last day on Earth track. Um, let's go to the PD. Now let's open up one blue crate and let's start the second raid of the day. We must know how you're able to work a full-time job like a dog and then come home and work like a dog again. I do not have a full-time job. I did have a full-time job, though, back in Lithuania. And it did work like a dog. But it is what it is. Why are you streaming so late? Um, I don't know. It depends for... Late for who? For some people, it is late. For other people, it's not that late. It depends. What do you think? Uh, will the eggs respawn if we select hard mode after clearing normal? Maybe there will be more. Uh, maybe. I have no idea. The Winchester. Thank you, game. Very cool. Drum magazine. Okay, we're going to get this. We're gonna get the Winchester, we're gonna get the Glock. Still can't believe I'm bringing that Winchester back home. Do we need to remind people of time zones? People will never remember about the time zones.
You work part-time or not at all because of all the money you make from streaming. Yes, I am a millionaire. <laughs> from all the streaming. Everything was a bit better, but now... Uh, no, I do not work part-time or full-time, luckily. But uh, how the things are going, I might actually need to get a job. And uh, either work part-time to continue with YouTube or just go full-time somewhere. I don't know. We'll have to see. I don't really think about that that much as of right now. That's the problem for the future, Cyric. The current Cyric is just raiding and that's it. Let's drop it back here and the Winchester goes back here. Bam. We got two more guns. And I think we can talk to the raiders and do the first raid of the day. Five iron hatchets. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And let's craft some armor. Three and four. That's it. We have everything. Let's do the second raid of the day. Why do I have these broken hatchets at the base? Maybe I could have given them to the raiders, but that's too late. I already deleted those hatches. Doesn't matter. Raiders will get nothing. Uh, we got this. Let's drop the plastic. Where do I store caps? There we go. How did I get 400 caps? When we had the Leprechaun's Lock event, I didn't have enough caps. Now I got 400 caps. It's not like those 400 caps would have changed anything, but still. Oh, because we've cleared the laboratory. That's what's up. That's how we've gotten more caps. I see. Let's get a Glock and another Glock, and we are ready. Actually, I'll just take these Glocks. Don't even have to modify them. Let's eat some carrots before we leave. Just so that I don't starve. Carrots are always nice. It's like, are you proud of the progress you made in last night? Very proud of the progress I made in last night. The only thing that motivates me in life is my last night progress. When I wake up, I'm like, damn. My progress in last night. I'm very proud of it. Extremely proud about it. Very proud. I have some pixels in last in Earth survival. Extremely proud. Uh, Aldi raid player 5901. Guys, are you proud of your progress? Are we all proud of our progress? Hell yeah, I've done enough research. I know how to raid this base. So let's hop here and let's see what this base has to offer. I had 15k caps and didn't do the event. I didn't feel it's worth wasting the caps. I mean, those are your caps. You can do whatever you want, but I think you've done a good job. Now you can let those caps rot. You could have gotten a slot machine that would be giving you like 10, 50 caps every day. So you could have gotten like 10, 15k caps probably in a year. You could have gotten those caps back. You could have gotten like a unique slot machine. You could have gotten like some other boxes, but now you get to look at those caps, I guess. So that's the right choice congrats you have the caps you can look at them i guess i don't know but all jokes aside those are your caps you can do whatever you want but that was probably the best time to spend those caps as usually you don't get anything else there are no better events than than the leprechaun's lock event for those caps so you could have at least like used those caps there it's not like you can do anything better with those caps you can just look at them and that's about it. So if you like looking at them, it is what it is. 
bro loves Last on Earth so much, he thinks of it as soon as he wakes up, says Peppy. Who said that I don't think about it when I sleep? I never stop thinking about Last on Earth. I sleep, I just dream about Last on Earth. I wake up, Last on Earth. Not a second goes by in my life when I don't think about Last on Earth. Like, do you play FIFA? Uh, no. And we got some ash planks and normal planks, a little bit of wood. And that's it. That was the raid, ladies and gents. I might as well bring some water back to the base. And some leather. That's it. That's about it. Nice, nice raid, ladies and gentlemen. How much money did you spend on Last on Earth? All of it. I blew all of my money on Last on Earth. Uh, yeah. On Last on Earth, everything. On coins, caps, on everything. Don't have a penny left. I live in a box. Now, how much money did you blow on Last on Earth Survival? How much do you pay for your uh, car insurance? How much do you pay for your health insurance? How much do you pay in social contributions or whatever? How much do you pay in taxes? Now it's my turn to ask questions. There we go. Now farm just gives one puppy. I think it was always giving one. Maybe sometimes it could give two, but that was pretty rare. Wait, we've just raided a base and that's it. We're back. I didn't even... Didn't even feel it. Unbelievable. How do we not get bored? Uh... A raiding machine. I'm a raiding machine. Not to mention the job he quit, so he has more time to play Last on Earth. Yes, indeed. The job he quit. The leather... Uh, where does it go? The brain is not braining, ladies and gentlemen. It has uh, short-circuited for a second, but hey, it worked. Are we gonna play Supermarket today too? Hopefully, we will play a little bit of Supermarket, yes. I love how I say hopefully. It's as if it doesn't depend on me. Okay, it depends on your behavior, guys. If you're nice, maybe we will play a little bit of Supermarket Simulator. Maybe, maybe. How did you manage to put the campfire on the floor? You could put those campfires before, like, whatever update. Then developers changed, and you're n you're n you're, you're no longer able to place campfires on the floor. But when the game came out, you could put them there, so... I have put them there, and... Now they're there. Uh, we can kill the witch, we can stand 20 zombies, the 20 police waves. Yeah, we can do this, ladies and gentlemen. So let's quickly do 20 waves. Let's kill the witch. If she's even reset, I'm not sure. Behave, says Eric. Yep. All you do, all you have to do, ladies and gentlemen, is to behave, and we will grind a little bit of supermarket simulator. I want supermarket today, so behave all of you, says Peppy. Heal ye. There's also gas station simulator. I do have it, but I haven't installed it yet. I already have the cap, so I'll be holding my cap. So the next thumbnail will be me holding the cap. I'm also going to get a a vest, the, the green vest or whatever. And I'll be just like standing there and smiling in the camera. And that'll be another thumbnail for the gas station simulator, ladies and gentlemen. And we might grind a little bit of gas station simulator in the next few days, I guess. Weed shop simulator. I wouldn't be surprised if that game exists. I'm pretty sure it exists. Can you imagine life without last generate? Nope. <sighs> At some point, guys, like, I like trolling, but I'm not sure if some of you are trolling or if some of you are real. <laughs> I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? 
How long you've been growing your hair? Uh, five years, maybe six. No, they're definitely not six years. Definitely not six. Five. Four or five. Mm, the brain is not braining. Uh, the witch and 20 waves. That's what we do. The witch and 20 waves. It's a wig. I've been growing this wig for five years. Red shots. Okay, that should be enough. Let's get 20. That's way too many guns, though. Didn't need to bring that many. Let's get nades. Haters will say those are extensions. If these are extensions, then these are pretty bad. Then these are pretty bad extensions. Could have gotten, like, something way bigger. But these are not extensions. Brain's not braining. The brain's not braining. Ladies and gentlemen, alert, alert. Okay, we're going to modify this. And we can start doing 20 waves. We're going to kill the witch on top of that. And another raid. So that'll be the third raid of the day. Are you a hacker, bro? How did you get uh, lots of weapons and things? I got lots of weapons and things by grinding this game for six years. So all you have to do is get rid of all of your friends. Don't have a social life. And just grind last on earth. Also, you you can check out my free to play playlist. Link is down in the description. Check out everything you need to know about last on earth. That video will definitely help you out a lot. It'll put you on the right track. You'll know what to do. And yeah, but long story short, the most important thing, basically like 70% of everything you need to know is clearing bunker alpha. Clear bunker alpha with wall tricks, with melee weapons, and you will get a lot of loot. And then when you level up, start doing raids. Raids are another big portion of your last dinner wealth. That's it. Let's start. Let's go to the PD. Let's do it. Do a torch only. What am I going to do with, with the torch? Serious, are you not even a little tired of last dinner after all these years? Says Muhammad Harris. It doesn't really matter. As I said, it doesn't matter what I feel. I said many times already. My feelings don't matter. Use the sound bite. Somebody once said that oh sorry got so lazy. He doesn't want to help newcomers. He even got the the crappy voiceover line. Ha ha ha. Cyric bad. And I'm just there sitting like, God damn man. How does this earth carry you? But I guess that dude now lives rent free in my head. So every time I think of turning on that sound bite, I can hear that dude in my head. Living rent free, so there's that. That's the story. Welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Welcome, welcome. Glad to see all of you here. Um, nothing, nothing. And let's start, ladies and gentlemen, the 20 waves. We're not going to do 99 waves because we've done those 99 waves quite recently. So all I want to do is just do 20 waves and then we can buckle up. Do you think Bunker Alpha wouldn't be worth it if there was no wall trick? Bunker Alpha still would be worth it because you'd have to sneak attack Frenzy Giants. And if you sneak attack every Frenzy Giant and then you kill them with Glocks or with whatever other broken weapons, then 
it will be more worth it because you get stuff like Winchesters, like Zip Guns from somewhere, maybe Flare Guns. And it's not like those guns are useful anyway, so you could use those trash guns on Frenzy Giants. So you kind of wouldn't even feel the difference. And on top of that, for the first maybe three or something years, I didn't use the wall trick because everybody just kept talking about that wall trick. It was annoying. Like all, all they did was like wall trick, wall trick, wall trick, wall trick. So I'm just like, okay, I'm going to do something different. And I never done any wall tricks. I just used guns and frenzy giants and that's it because I wanted to show people that, hey, there's another strategy. So, they, so since day one on Lies and Earth, I always try to show that, hey, there are different strategies. There isn't only like one strategy. Now it's a little bit different. I do believe it's a lot faster to use your melee weapons and just do the wall trick. Because you will save a lot of weapons. But it is also possible without the wall trick. But it will, it will take a lot longer. So it is better for you to learn the wall trick. It's like, why did you move to France? I also live in France, says Matthews. My girlfriend is from France. That's the long story short. Will you clear the transport up to date? Today's the day when I do lots of raids. I thought I smelled smoke. But now I'm just imagining. Uh... I've burnt bread in the toaster so many times that now I just smell burnt bread everywhere. I'm gonna start a new trend, right? People were making fun of my burnt eggs, now they'll make fun of my burnt toasts. I was at the store today, and I got like three types of different breads. I cannot wait to toast them. That's all I have to say. Getting obsessed with toasts. With toasting bread. Can you speak French? A little. I'd just like to say that no, I do not speak French and that's it. Saying when you speak a little French, that means you speak pretty well, but you, I do not speak pretty well. Burnt eggs on burnt toast. Welcome to Happy Sarks Livestream. And then you ask me guys to make a cooking video. I said that I'll do that cooking video. But yeah. Burnt eggs on burnt toast. What's your favorite zombie? What is your favorite zombie, guys? How many waves today? We're just doing 20 waves. Welcome to those that have just joined. We are doing 20 waves. Because that's what raiders wanted me to do. And as soon as we are done with this, we're going to do another raid. That'll be the third raid of the day. Hopefully today at least one raid will be nice. Because the previous two raids were kind of trash. Or as some people would call them, rubbish. Those raids were rubbish. Oh, Happy Cyric. Welcome, welcome. You didn't clap, there we go, now it's clapping. Uh, let's go here. Let's start another wave. Do you have connections with last and our developers? Not really. I am a partner. I don't like that word. But in any case, I am their partner. And every month I get to request some items. So usually I just request coins so I can do more raids. NC Force, and that's about it. That's my whole connection with them. If you mean connections, like, can I ask them to add new updates or... Can I ask them for the helicopter or anything? Then no. Is there a reason you barely use leg shot or other active skills on your weapons? Those active skills usually use more durability on your weapons. Like, for example, the spread shot uses three shots instead of just one shot. Leg shot maybe uses two shots, maybe it uses one shot. And it's not that useful anyways. Zombies will just slow down. 
So it's not like the active perk is nice. So the long story short, I guess, most of the active perks just suck. Even that leg shot. I use that leg shot on raids when the big one is chasing me. And I need to raid more things. And I need to open up more chests. But most of the time, the active mods are just useless. Where should I use my grenades? Farm PD or Bunker Alpha? We should probably use it at the PD. But use them wherever you want. Wherever your, uh, your heart desires. If you want to use them doing the grenade trick at Bunker Alpha, do it there. If you want to do 99 waves, then save up 99 grenades and do 99 waves. CEO of Kefir. Welcome, it's me, Happy Psyche, CEO of Last and Earth Survival. Smash like, smash subscribe, helicopter is coming. What if the devs came out and said that, hey, the helicopter is coming, let's say, in 2028, 20, in four years from now? So we have a roadmap. And the helicopter is coming in 2028. Twenty twenty eight. What would your response be? Count every second until the end for four years. <laughs> okay. I guess it would depend what kind of updates we'd get until twenty twenty eight. But like until twenty twenty eight, we'll have nothing. We'll get another leprechauns lock event. We'll get four more leprechauns lock events, and we'll get four more Easter bunny events. Four more New Year events. And then we'll give you the helicopter. And then when the helicopter comes out in 2028, it's... It's for the expeditions. Bro, why are you ignoring me? It says dynamic GG uh, with full caps. I apologize. Hopefully you can forgive me. After the live stream, I'm going to give you my channel as an apology. Heck, I'm also going to give you my apartment. I do not have an apartment, but I'll be paying rent. I'll give you the apartment. I'll continue paying rent. I'll live in the box. I'm sorry, dude. Heck, I'll even give you my lungs, my kidneys. Just please forgive me. What else can I give away, ladies and gentlemen? What else can I give as an apology? Help me out here. Are you still practicing guitar? I haven't practiced guitar in months. Sadly. That is a little bit sad. I would like to practice the, the guitar a bit more often. But, uh... Everything has... Finite time. And currently, I do not have enough time to grind on the guitar. Again... I don't like saying I don't have enough time because you can make time for anything, like literally anything. So if I really wanted it, I could make time for it. So I guess I don't really want it enough to make time for it. Give away the guitar. It's my guitar. Why would I give it away? I'm going to play it maybe later. Oh, give away the guitar as a, as a gift. Yes, I'm going to give away the guitar. So I'm gonna give away the guitar, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna give away my lungs, my... Uh, my kidneys, and my guitar. Thank you. Give away your account. Nah, that's stepping over the line. He's not getting my account. Hey, I might give away everything. I might have only one lung. I might have only one kidney. But goddamn, I'm gonna still have my last on Earth account. He's not getting it. Yeah. 
You only said 20 waves. I still have one more grenade, so I thought I'll use this grenade. Didn't want to bring home anything spare. So I'm gonna use these nades. I'll do a spread shot. That was the last wave. And then we're going home. Give me your leg. I don't need legs to play last in Earth Survival. I'll give away the leg as well, I guess. And that's it. We have raided. We've done 20 waves. Sadly, I've only gotten one blow. A little bit disappointing, but that's all right. I guess that was uh, expected. That was to be expected. Now let's exchange all of them for green. And let's go back home. Whatever, let's open up a blue card as well. Kind of didn't want to open it up because we don't have a lot of space in the base, but hey, let's open it up. You guys are here already. Might as well just open another Winchester. I regret opening it up. I blame you for everything. Thank you for coming to my dead dog. Now let's kill the witch. I have shotguns. I have an AK. I have some armor. Do you own a console, Cyric? I do have a PS4, but don't use it. I got it to play... Uh, what is the game? The Last of Us. I got it to play The Last of Us. I also played Detroit Become Human. I played Until Dawn. And that's about it. I don't think I've played anything else on the console. Maybe there was some other games. I also got Red Dead Redemption on it. Red Dead Redemption too. But I haven't touched it in a very long time. Teach me how to do wall trick. Check out everything you need to know. Video, check out free to play playlist. Will you play GTA 6? Perhaps. Perhaps, perhaps. When it comes out. As I already said, probably GTA 6 will come out before the helicopter. So maybe I will grind G the GTA 6. Everybody will be playing it, I guess. Okay, let's deal with the witch real quick. Play last in it when it comes in console. Probably not going to be very soon. I don't think it ever... It's ever coming to consoles. So yeah, I don't think it's ever coming... Oh no, my actually armor can break! You know what I think? I think a spread shot, spread shotting them near the chopper is better because you can kind of clump them up together in a thinner line because they're near the chopper. Kinda, maybe, I don't know. Last night will be GTA 6's biggest competitor. <laughs> sure, I agree. On which emulator are you playing? Blue Stacks. I use Blue Stacks. Have you tried Chilla's art games? They're dope. Haven't heard of that. Okay, let's get another spread shot. More first aid kits. Let's deal with the disease wolf over real quick. So I have no clue what is Chilla's art games. Okay, let's wait here for a second until they come. And now we're gonna do the spreadsheet. Dude, that's perfect! I think I finally found a idiot-proof way to spreadsheet. Just spreadsheet them around the chopper because they clump up here around the chopper. Genius, ladies and gentlemen. I am a bloody genius. Smash like, smash subscribe. But, Sarek, I don't have a chopper. Actually, not a lot of you probably even have the spreadsheet, so that's sad. I always said... And I'll repeat it again. First of all, I want the spreadsheet to be manual. Yo, Rudy! Wada gave me the power to make people go away. Please mute her. And screw that guy who talked mess about the voiceover. He is the one who is crappy. He still lives rent free in my head. Rudy, thank you for the super chat. Thank you for being here. I don't think I can ban and mute anybody. But I guess for $5? Sayonara, wanna. I'm, I'm 
I, I sold my soul for five dollars. Say thanks, Rudy. Thanks for being here. Thank, thank you. Also, she gave you that power. Why would I mute her? Why aren't you happy with the new powers? Sorry, you look like PewDiePie on cracks as Tiger last on Earth. <laughs> It's so funny. <laughs> Tiger Lazarner, that is actually funny. I've never seen and heard a funnier joke. Thanks, homie. Thank you. Whew, that was a good one. I thought my heart is gonna stop from laughter. Thank you. Say that dude that said that I shouldn't use the bite sound, the the voiceover line, because I am uh, too lazy to to answer newcomers. Yeah, that dude still lives rent free in my head, and I don't think I can do anything about that. I just admit it, I just accept it. Yeah, some people live rent free in my head. It's fine, I'm fine with it. As they say, you can't choose your neighbors. He lives rent free. So maybe he's not my neighbor. In any case, you can't choose your neighbors. You don't choose your family. Only thing you can choose are your actions. So that's it. Do you still remember who it is? Even if I remembered, even if I knew their name, I wouldn't say it out loud. That wouldn't be nice of me. For a sec First of all, I would be giving them too much exposure. And that wouldn't be nice of me. If somebody said something mean about me, I'm not going to expose them. Which also, I don't think that was mean. I'm not saying that that was like, wow, the worst thing I've ever heard. And I'm, I also don't think that they are right by no means. But it still doesn't mean that somebody can't live rent free. It's mostly like a joke. The dude doesn't really live rent free. I don't really care about that, but just thought it's funny to mention it. I just wanted to use the phrase living rent free in my head. That's it. Ah, the brain is not braining again, ladies and gentlemen. The brain ain't braining. Let's drop the caps. Let's drop the big bones. If they stack, they do stack indeed. Names, we need names. Nah, guys, you're not getting any names. The iron hatchets and four... Four, four... Armor pieces. Let's get this. Let's get it and let's roll. Yo, Menzen, welcome to the stream. Love your videos and streams. Keep up the good work. Thanks, Menzen. Welcome to the stream. Chill hard games. They're short Japanese horror games, but they are so good. I... Haven't heard of that. Maybe I have seen a video actually quite recently on it, maybe. It's the game in the in the train. It's like a it's like a short horror game where you walk through the train and things change. Then maybe I have seen it. What else do I need to do? I keep looking at it. Okay, five hatchets. Let's get the five hatchets. Mia! Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hello, mister. What did I miss? Working like a dog. Welcome to the stream, Mia. Welcome, welcome. I haven't started working like a dog at the end of the live stream. We're going to play like a dog. We're going to grind a little bit of supermarket simulator. But not yet. Uh, we've done... Uh, two raids. This will be the third raid. C-Rec. Where can I find the resources to upgrade storage at base? Depends what resources. <sighs> it's a very broad question. You just ask, like, how do... They, I, I don't know, man. It's a very, very broad question. What resources? You need basically everything to upgrade your base? You can get wood in wood zones. Missed it because you're old. It's fine. It's fine.
previous raids any good or some goop bases. Goop. None of them have gotten Cyrix approval, and Cyrix approval is very low already. It's easy to get Cyrix approval. So those raids were pretty bad. That's why I'll say. Hopefully this raid is a bit better. We have 28 duct tape. Wait, are we running low on duct tape? Wait a minute. Are we really? Okay, we might be running low on duct tape. Do I have any duct tape in the inbox? Maybe it's not in the resource tab. Is it in the resource tab? Uh, no, it's not. And I have 500 duct tape here. Okay, so we're good, ladies and gentlemen. Even if we run out of that duct tape, we still have enough other oh, of other duct tape in the inbox. Duct tape. The best human invention ever, in my humble opinion. So like 100 MGLs and 200 steel, right? Yep. That's what I've gotten. Nothing too much. But hopefully this raid is going to be nice. Maybe this raid will bring us 100 MGLs and 200 steel. And the helicopter. I keep going up there to upgrade those guns. But I keep forgiving. Not him flexing his mailbox. Guys, I'm not flexing my mailbox. There's nothing to flex. It's a pixel game. I'm 27 year old. Sitting in the room playing a mobile game on an emulator. How is this flexing? How any of this is flexing, ladies and gentlemen? God damn it. Didn't flex anything. Um, let's drop another C4 here. And let's roll on this dirty chopper. Look at all of those stakes. What a flex. Yes, indeed. Flex. Stakes. With 500 duct tape, we can tape our enemies to Eiffel Tower. I'll do your raid. Mike 88. Is it a good raid? Ladies and gentlemen, your mind will be blown from this raid. You'll be shocked. And shaking from... I don't know what. And then the base has three carrots and five ropes. We'll have Cyrix approval. Sometimes those bases do get Cyrix approval. I also think it depends... How interesting is the base? If it's like a 3x3 stone base, it's not interesting to raid it. Do I go up here? I don't even know where to go. I've done a little bit of research, but I'm not sure even. I think I could have just placed a C4 on this and that's it. Okay, let's place a C4 here. Maybe that'll work. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the raid number three of the day. I don't know what kind of loot we'll get here. So I guess we'll about to see. We are about to see. Will Sari get 20 grenade launchers? Will I get a helicopter? Keep watching to find out. We've gotten berries. Is that happy or no? I'm not sure if I have to play the happy sound effect or a sad sound effect. I'm not sure. I don't know how I feel about that yet. Hola, como estas? My French is getting better, right, Sykes? Is, is yep. Your French is absolutely getting better. The lessons are paying off. C4 wasted for real. It's fine, ladies and gentlemen. It's all for the raiders. It's all for the content. Will I be able to open up all of these chests? 
before the big one. I don't know. There we go. We didn't have enough duct tape. Now we can get more duct tape. Let's soften some of these chests. Three. Three. And let's soften all of these chests up there. Play the link in the description sound by... Rope, uh, wood. Is this a real survivor's base? Nope. You do not raid real players. This is a boy. This and uh, iron. Okay, 98 noise. I'm gonna drop some stuff in the chopper. Oh, uh, what will I drop even? I don't even know. I'm gonna get carrots instead. I'm, I'm seriously bringing more carrots back to the base. What else can I bring? Nothing, apparently. Imagine if you can raid real players. That would be a nightmare. Yep. This game is not meant to raid real players. If you could raid real players, that would be a mess. If you could raid real players, then that would be maybe the kind of pay to win. Like, I'd like real player raids. But they'd have to be different. Some things would have to be different. Okay, let's open up another chest. Nothing, just bricks. Uh, first eight kits with gasolinium. And uh, we got some of this. Whatever I just left there, it's fine. Okay, we're gonna heal up. And there's just beans. That's it, it's fine. Let's leave this base. So does this base get Sykes approval? Probably does. It does. didn't have like insane loot. It's not like a 10 out of 10 base. But it was an interesting base a more interesting than other bases it had lots of chests and it did have a little bit of loot i'm not coming back home empty-handed so whatever it gets like approval however if i'd gotten this raid on my free to play account i would have been very upset this is a pretty trash raid when i think about it maybe i don't know it's a goop right that's that's what it is but it does get Sykes approval because it could have been worse You get the resources, but the player doesn't lose resources. So you raid real players, but they don't lose resources. I'm kind of lost. How would that work? How would you get revenge raids? Hmm. Okay, let's drop the carrots in one of the chests. Okay, they don't fit. Rip berry tea. Guys, we're not going to take that berry tea. Forget the berry tea. Keep this just here. More coupons. And that was raid number... What? Number three? Are we going to do another raid? Raid number four? Are you kidding me? Wait, sorry, how do you even get white paint? You can get white paint from raids. That's how I've gotten most of my white paint. Like, probably 99% of it. You can also get some white paint from floppy crates. You don't get a lot of it, but you do get a little bit of white paint there. You missed two floppy crates, dude. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'll take those floppy crates off camera. Yes. Let's talk to the raiders. Let's give them a spear. They are pretty happy with it. And let's try to do another raid. So that was a third raid. Let's try to do a fourth raid.
the revenge raid would say Psych has raided your base and you choose to raid it. It would be a revenge raid. But whenever you get a revenge raid, like they say what was stolen from your base. So if I raided your base and I stole, let's say, stack of first aid kits, like you would have to lose them. Otherwise, revenge isn't really revenge if I have stolen nothing. Am I right? We got disassembled three guns. Easy. Easy, ladies and gents. Okay, let's do those. And uh, fifth floor, we got to destroy five turrets. Let's get a couple of guns. Let's get the true friend Doggo. And let's quickly clear the fourth floor before we do the fourth raid. Fourth floor for the fourth raid, ladies and gentlemen. Is that a coincidence? I don't think so. Brain, brain, it is braining a little bit, not too much though. I wanted a stack of a turkey to give that to the doggos. Did Sark just say fifth floor? I said fourth floor. I don't think I said the fifth floor. Forend. This is the yes, it's not fourth, it's forend. Second, forend. Fifth, and this. Do I have any broken guns? To break further so that I have more space in the base. I also haven't cleared the transport up yet today. Let's get an M16. That's enough. For now, let's modify those. The armor is about to break. When it breaks, I'll get another one from the inbox. I should be using it from the base, though, to have more space, but... Can you play more Pacific Drive? Perhaps one day. Probably not gonna play it. It's an awesome game. I'd love to play more Pacific Drive, but I don't think I can play more. It's not up to me. Okay, let's drop the rest of the resources back at the base. That bike is so dirty. It's like a camouflage pattern. I barely see that bike. Not enough guns. Maybe that'll be enough guns. Maybe I did take too many guns, actually. Maybe you are right. What happens if you refuse the raider's tasks? Nothing. They'll go away. Then you can call them again, and... You'll have to do the same tasks again. You're not gonna get different tasks. You'll have to do the same exact tasks. You're not gonna skip those tasks. Uh... Brain, brain, please, brain. It's not braining. We got a couple of guns to drop. Okay, there we go. We did it. And the C4 on top of that. Okay, it doesn't fit. The C4 does not fit. Okay, now everything fits. Let's give the doggos. Let's feed them. I'm farming lots of carrots and carrot stew just in case I need for the new bunny event. Good luck with that. I don't think you'll need it though, but again, we never know. As I said, I think the follow the bunny event will be like the collecting the posters event. Except the posters will be collecting eggs. YouTube is lagging. It doesn't lag on my side. I apologize that it's lagging. Please forgive me. Um, We're going somewhere. I don't remember where I'm going. Oh, to clear the fourth floor. It's going to be in hard mode, though. It's like took so many guns as he's about to clear all the floors. I mean, the fourth floor will take a lot of guns. It's like, can you life without LDOE? I don't know. Guess we're about to find out. What's better, modded AK or modded M16? Modded AK. And it's not even close. Every time I come in, I always see a smile here. I said that many times already, but look at these are the eyes, and this is a smile. I can't unsee it anymore. You're welcome. You're not going to unsee it either, I guess. 
Is the arena reset worth it? If you have the coins and if you have the guns and if you want to reset it and if you feel like it's worth it, then it's worth it. There we go. I think that's the best answer I can give. Why, says Dark? Why? What? I can't unsee it now. Well, welcome. I know it's not on your end. It's been like this for 10 minutes. I am sorry that it's lagging. Thanks for everything, homie. I apologize that it's lagging. It is my fault. I take full responsibility. Blame me. It's like, why don't you take your dog with you anymore? I'm sorry, I'll take my dog next time. I made a mistake. I forgot to take the doggo. I'll bring the dog next time. Gooper doesn't get brought in walks anymore. Yep. It's fine. He's chilling at the base. It's like, do you approve of the true friend dog? Not really. Some people think that the true friend dog is like something insane here in the game. They feel like... Some people feel like the true friend dog will... Will change everything. If they get it. It's It's pretty useless. It is pretty bad. Some people want it, but it is useless. Like, for real, for real. I'm not even kidding. I need to go and Google this word, DA. I know what it means, but I'm not sure how do you pronounce it. Either Kanoe or Kano. Kano. I think it's canoe. Canoe sounds good. Canoe sounds good. I'm pretty sure it's canoe. Canoe. God damn it, I did it. It's canoe. So the true friend dogway is like a handbrake on a canoe. There we go. That sounds a lot better. I just I just pronounced it and I figured out how to pronounce it. Genius, ladies and gentlemen. Absolute genius. Canoe. I did it. I'm I'm happy. I'm happy about that. Hell yeah. I think it was the first time that I had to pronounce that word. Like, I've heard it many times, but I never had to say Kano myself. So there we go. I think I said it now three or four times during the live stream. Hell yeah! But that's a good metaphor. I like it, DA. Thank you. I like it. The drone is the new doggo. Yep, that's why the drone is chilling at the base as well. I just want the true friend doggo to take him to green locations. Maybe that'd be cool. I mean, the true friend doggo doesn't have to be this difficult. That's all I have to say. Maybe if it wasn't as difficult, it'd be more worth it. I think that's my... That's my... Verdict. That's it. If it was easier to obtain, if all you had to do is just find, like, a couple of Duggos and you get that true friend Duggo guaranteed. Like, if you breed, like, two level four Duggos, you'll get almost a guaranteed true friend Duggo. Then, yeah, sure. Why not? It's kind of useful. You can bring it to the green zones then. Sure. But by the time you get that true friend Duggo, you're not going to grind green zones anymore. And if you are grinding them, it doesn't really matter anyways because you've been playing this game for a long time. So... You can already survive without the true friend doggo. I think that's the problem. It, it could be nice if it was a lot easier to get. I get your point. Honestly, it shouldn't be that hard to get it. It's not like it's a game changer, says Shag Zaib. Yep, that's, th th that's basically the whole point. Yep. Equipment and pants. I want to break this first. 
Well, why am I standing there? I remember the first time the fourth floor came out. Kind of remember it a bit. I have no idea. I am pretty sure there is a live stream or a video. I'm pretty sure there is a video. At that time, I wasn't live streaming that often. I am pretty sure there is a video of me experiencing the first, uh, the fourth floor for the first time. Just have to like dig around and find it. Thought your goal was to destroy the turrets. Yep. I don't really destroy those bigger turrets as they have a lot of health. So I try to destroy the smaller turrets. I've got an M16. Doug was a true friend and he aggroes the dead face. And you get melted. Who's dead face? Are we having a late supermarket shift, perhaps? And take care, Mia. Thanks for being here. Take care, take care. So maybe after we do the fourth raid, maybe we'll do the another shift. But I also wanted to clear the transport hub, so I haven't cleared the transport hub yet. But I wanted to clear the transport hub. It's not like I'm not going to be able to fall asleep if I don't clear it. It was just on the menu today. What's up, Sec? What's, uh, how's today going, says Danny Boy. Today's going great. Hopefully your day's going great as well. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Today we are raiding. Soon we're going to do the fourth raid of the day. Let's get another shotgun. And let's destroy this heavy turret. It doesn't even make a lot of sense. But there's a chest, and most of the time this chest doesn't have any loot. They should definitely give better loot inside of this chest. Like, it's it's just nothing. One copper bar. It, it wasn't worth the gun that I wasted here. And I don't even know if you're always... If you always get that copper there. I don't think you always get it. Speaking of menu, what's for dinner? You guys already know what's for dinner. Food. We're eating food. Five eggs. And, uh, I don't know, pasta. Quinoa, maybe. We're gonna work like a dog today? Yes, perhaps at the end of the live stream. I know the answer, pasta, quinoa. Yep, there will be pasta, quinoa, and eggs. Also, I did get different bread today. So I'm excited to toast some bread. Francis Giant wanted to hit me, but he couldn't do it. Sick. Should I start over last dinner because the game doesn't show me any more that I can raid and I only raided like five times, says Noah. You need to level up in order to raid more. You have to be level 150 and then you'll be able to do more raids. Crowd shot should be a thing in this game. There is a crowd shot with the VSS. A crowd shot mod, but it's kind of useless. I think it uses two or three shots and it doesn't do a lot of damage. You haven't eaten lentils in a while. Are you okay? Mm. 
Mm, I guess I'm okay. Let me check my pulse. I guess I'm fine. Yeah, I'm fine. Still alive, still breathing. Usually lentils are, I'd say, maybe heavier than pasta or quinoa. So I usually try to eat something lighter for the evening, something that I can eat easier. I'll save lentils for the for lunch, maybe. For breakfast? But I haven't eaten them for lunch in many moons either, so. Do you lose durability if you fire spread shot at anything? I don't remember. No, you don't. Apparently, you do not. You left the body there. No! I'll take it off camera, guys. I don't want to waste your time by me going there and getting that body. I'll get that loot off camera. Absolutely. Are we doing Supermarket Simulator today? Yes. I'm, I'm happy that a lot of people are asking for the Supermarket Simulator. I know it's a silly game. But I'm glad to hear that people like it. Okay, let's bring the loot back to the base. Doing arena event today. I don't know, maybe. It's boring. What's boring, Blubby Hunter? Blubby. Blubby. What's boring, homie? And don't you dare to say Supermarket Simulator. You're playing last day on Earth, goddammit. How can Supermarket be boring? How dare you call Supermarket Simulator silly? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say that it's silly. Supermarket is the best game ever created after Last Day on Earth. I'm sorry. Hey, bro, man, dude, welcome to the stream, Insomniac. Welcome, welcome. I was able to catch you live. I'm so happy. want to be here when you shop. I'm actually really liking the shopping game. You're the, I don't know, 10th? dozenth person that has said that they like the supermarket simulator. I'm gonna grind some supermarket at the end of the live stream. Yes, indeed. Welcome to the stream. Um... Let's store the food. And some other stuff. And when I say I'll take it off camera, I'm not taking it off camera. I think it's a joke and everybody understood that. But to those that didn't understand, I'm not taking anything off camera. When I say I'll take it off camera, I'm not taking it off camera. I know. A shocker, right? But I guess I'll say this before I get cancelled for something. Oh, you kept, you kept lying to us. Um, three guns to recycle and a blue crate. Let's get that blue crate. Motel went. Stop it! The next person that speaks about the motel, they get a gift. A permanent ban, so go on, try me. I'm kidding, guys. Nobody's getting banned. Or are you getting banned? Um, I forgot what I'm doing. That's the difficult part about Last Night. I've played it for six years. Most of the things are just happening on autopilot. And if I just get stuck, I don't know what I'm doing. Because I'm not actively thinking what I need to do here. Most of the things just happen. But in any case... Motel, guys, stop it. Stop talking about the motel. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to smell it. Do you know more places where I can motorcycle parts? I just need the wheel and tire, but I keep getting the gas tank. Any suggestions, says Noah. Uh, no. The farm location and bunker alpha yellow and red crates. 
at the farm location, you can open up the chopper thing when you get the key. And at the bunker alpha, open up yellow and red crates, and that's where you get those items. I might not... I might be mistaken, I think you can also get some of the chopper parts from the survivor's path. So check out your inbox, maybe you already have your one chopper wheel or something. Maybe you get a gas tank from it, maybe you get a chopper fork. I don't know, you do get something from the... From that thing, from the inbox. So maybe check your inbox, maybe you already have something. Um, let's open up one more blue crate. Let's go. It's like take the true friend to the supermarket. That would be cool. They need to add doggos to the supermarket. So that you need to buy food. As I said, in the supermarket, they need to add lunch breaks as well. So every time after 12 p.m., you can't run. You'll just be walking. And in order to run, you have to go and have lunch. You take like some sort of a burrito, frozen burrito. You put it in the microwave. You wait five seconds. So the game forces you to stay still for five seconds or something. Or you can like run around, whatever. You got to wait five seconds until it warms up. And then you eat it and then you can run again. Hell yeah. Uh, let's go there. They added new events to the yellow location. Yesterday, I got a full motorcycle armor set and a revolver from some cultists. They've added those things quite a while ago. But yes, we do have like some sort of random events in yellow, green, and even red zones. That actually sounds fun. It does sound fun. I agree. I quit last night for eight months, came back for a lucky event, got true friend Rod Weiler with three bleeding perk, like a boss. Congrats on that. Still don't have my Rod Weiler. I'm just glad I have this dude and that's fine. It's totally fine. Let's drop it here. And another Winchester, the 343, dude. I've opened up three blue crates. That's the third Winchester that I get today. I'm getting scammed left and right. So, to those that have joined to the stream, I've opened up one purple, uh, one blue, and the second blue crate, and both of those had Winchesters. So, that's my third Winchester of the day from the blue crates. Disappointed. Disappointment is immeasurable. The day isn't ruined, I'd say. It's fine. Such a little thing shouldn't ruin your day. If it does ruin your day, then... Uh... Yeah. When were you last time in the motel? So the reason why I don't like the motel, I think one of the reasons is, first of all, it's useless. Second of all, it doesn't have any loot. Third of all, I might be doing anything else. And, like, fourth of all, I remember when motel came out... It was one of the, maybe not worst updates, but... So anytime you get a Last Earth update, the viewership peaks, either during live streams or uh, or videos or whatever. Anytime you get a new update, more people are interested in Last Earth survival, more people watch Last Earth survival videos. And usually, like when we got the farm location, people, the it peaked. And that peak stayed for a while. Like anytime we got, like let's say, Bunker Bravo, it peaked and it stayed for a while. We got the motel, it peaked. And then the viewership dropped below normal. It went below normal, I'm not even kidding. So anytime I'd like talk about the motel, anytime I do anything remotely close to the motel, people would leave. Because it's motel, it's trash. Same thing like farming wood. Anytime you go to farm wood, people don't care about that. So I dread the motel. I avoid it like a plague. Because if I go to the motel, some people will leave the live stream. I mean, if I have to go to the motel, I'll go to the motel. It's fine. If some people leave, they leave. But I mean, if I don't have to go there, why would I go there? Why would I willingly go to the motel? But again, that's just from my personal experience. I said so, says Wana. Okay. Please don't scream at me. The only th two things to get are the grenade. Then the car trunk might have a shot. Yeah, you know, getting the uh, grenade there is nice. I always 
forget to mention that you get a grenade there. Yes, the motel is nice to get the grenade. At least you get a guaranteed grenade. You avoided like grass. I don't avoid like grass. A couple of days ago, I touched uh, grass. Uh, where is it? There we go. A couple of days ago. When was it? I don't know when it was, but a few days ago, ladies and gentlemen, it touched grass. And I have this picture and it'll stay here. That's it. Smash like, smash subscribe. If you like touching grass as well. I'm gonna drop them here. I'll store them in the pickup truck. Glocks, not blocks. Did I call them blocks? Scum Survival has blocks instead of blocks, though. Do you work out? Yes, I've done three and a half push-ups today. And two and a half squats. And I've done one and a half uh, crunches. Fitness isn't... Just a thing. Fitness is a lifestyle. Thing. I didn't get the Glocks. Almost left this base without the Glocks. Focus, says Matthew. I am trying to focus. This doesn't work like that. Don't yell at me, I'm sensitive. Uh, everything's fine, we can go. Sometimes when I, when I get stuck, I'll either read a chat and I'll see a comment and I'll just run that comment through my head and I'll see if I can answer that comment and if I can't answer it, I try to find a different way of how I could answer it. So I just like simulate what would happen if I answer it. And sometimes I answer it and sometimes I'm like, nope. And that's it. So sometimes that's why I get stuck. LDV raid Godfather. Is that a good raid? Is that a nice raid or is this? Just a raid. Okay, so I think I know how to enter this raid, ladies and gentlemen, through here. This is a messy base. Um, I think I know how to raid this. It's pretty messy, so I'm just going in. It's like, what do you think of Jurassic Survival? One of the best games ever created that changed my life. Uh, if it gets updates and bug fixes, would people play it? Absolutely. They'd quit everything. They'd quit their jobs to play that game. It's concept of it being dinosaur world is very interesting. It's very interesting. I agree with you. One of the best concepts. One of the best games I've ever heard. The moment I played Jurassic Survival, my life changed. Which comment was it? I don't even remember. And it's not always about the comments. Sometimes like I'll want to maybe like talk about something and I'll run that topic first uh, in my head. I'll simulate that topic in my head and I'm like, nah, that's goop. So I just move on. Okay, let's open up another wall. Oh lord. Can I go through here? Nope. Like, for example, that's the comment. Somebody said, that's why you ignore me. And I'm like, what do I answer to that comment? I don't know. 
So sometimes I'll be stuck, I'll think about it, and I have nothing to say, so I'm just like, whatever. Energy cost is very low to go to another place. Why? I don't know. I do not have the VAP now, so I don't know why the energy cost is lower. The energy cost probably gets a bit lower when... With some... I don't think you get lower perks with passive skills. Lower energy with those passive skills. I don't know. Nothing there. You say the truth, for example. Yes, one. I think your topics are trash. I don't think your topics are trash, though. Do you have plans to upload nine game related content? No. Because what would I upload? Cyric fix here, and today we're fixing the car. Engine. All we need is a screwdriver. And a hammer. <laughs> and that's it. We're fixing the pistons today. Smash like, smash subscribe. Thing. Are you kidding me? Am I getting scammed? Did I... Okay, I need to soften this chest. Did I soften everything else? Did I soften these chests? I don't think so. Did I leave anything in the chopper? Nothing because nothing... I don't have anything to leave in the chopper. Oh, we got some fuel. I'm gonna steal that fuel. Thank you very much. There we go. Why can't we don't update bigger than this updates? It's a very nice question. Thank you. And I don't know why we're not getting more updates. It's been a hot minute since you made some new merch, t-shirts, and mugs. We need new Happy Psych Supermarket uh, apron that says life is works as insomniac. I don't really focus on merch right now. Last day on earth is dying. Channel is dying. I'm just hanging by by my pinkies. And the last thing I think about is new merch. That's basically long story short and right to the point. I can't. I don't have any more hatchets. Will, will, will. I'm gonna go maybe outside to get a hatchet because we are already here anyways. Um, let's get a couple of tools. Let's get a couple of iron hatchets. Sark, you're a tool! Ha ha ha! That's very funny. Let's go back to the base. And new locations like cities and suburbs, that'd be amazing. I'd love to get cities and suburbs. My life would be complete then, I agree with you. Can I go up here? Yes, I can. I can go through here. Can I open this up? Of course not. Still got damage. Whoa, heal, heal, heal! Nothing useful. Can I open up this one? Nope. Uh, I only have 13 first aid kits. You know what? I'm leaving this base. There's nothing in it. I think Cashier Psych is going to revive the channel. Sure. It's 
So let's go back to the base. Was this raid worth it? We did get three stacks of planks. Not even three full stacks of planks. They should add some sort of currency and supermarket in game. There's already dollar currency. And there's already a supermarket in game. You can already buy things from this supermarket with your currency. Imagine we got an update, the supermarket, but the supermarket is just like this store that you see here, but it's just like in like in an environment in, in like in space. You know what I mean? You touch, let's say like this chest or whatever, boom, and here you can buy like guns. It's like a real store. It's just so that you get to walk through that store. These rays are not funny. They're just so sad. How did you get three stacks of blanks? I have no idea how we got only three stacks of blanks. I'll do one more raid. Just so that it's... I mean, five isn't a round number. But just so that it's five raids. Because the title says raids. Everything says raids. So I might as well just do another raid. So we're just going to skip every task right now. Just to do another raid. And then we'll hop to the supermarket simulator. So hopefully this next raid is a bit better. But if it's not better, then hey guys, it's not my fault. Where are the raiders? Cyric, the the raider. Uh, Twenty waves. I've just done that. This done. Oh, luckily I had. I would have had to skip those tasks anyways. So I'm just gonna skip them, and that's it. Is the area worth it? The area. I think it meant the arena. It depends. If you want mods and perhaps a tactical backpack, then maybe it is worth it. The keyword is maybe. If you don't need those, then maybe it's not worth it. Whoops. Uh, let's get this. Let's do the fifth raid of the day, ladies and gentlemen. Since I started playing again, I started collecting 2k ash logs a day. Finished my base finally up to 8k logs at my base so far. I'm a grinder for life like you, Cyrix is Insomniac. I think your name is true. Please keep posting Lego videos. BTW, I've been a follower and watched your videos since the beginning. Keep them coming, brother. Brother, the, the way uh, the way Brian said that. Thank you, Nico uh, Volschenk. Thank you for the super chat. I'm glad you're enjoying Last and Earth content. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for being here for a long time on the channel. It's always nice to hear. And there will be more Last Dinner videos. So no worries about that. Thanks for everything, Nico. The brain's not braining now. The brain is in braining. The copper is in coppering. And the red ticket has to go outside. Your longest raid video was 10 raids. Yes, I think I've made only 8 raids. I don't think I went to 10 raids. Glad to hear that, says Nico. I'm glad to hear that too. We're all glad. The circle of glad people. Welcome.
Welcome to the glad circle. Where everybody's glad. Alright, let's hope that this raid is a bit better. Are you ready, buckaroos? Are you ready to buckle up? I'm ready. The surfboard backpack. It's not summer yet. It's not summer. It cannot be the, su the surfboard backpack. Say, so, hey, Nico Volschenk, thanks once again for the super chat. Thank you for being here. You're just in time for an epic raid, hopefully. Elder raid Nikki. Please, something nice. Okay, this raid is at least maybe good. I guess so, ladies and gentlemen. Let's just do some research. Ladies and gentlemen, you might have hit a jackpot. Cue the music. I don't even know what kind of music is this, but... I cued the jackpot. Okay, so I've done the research, ladies and gentlemen. I did it. At least it's going to be an alright raid. Do we have an Easter backpack? I don't know. Did you see that they have 50 cent pieces in the supermarket register? Yes. You don't have 50 cents in... You do have 50 cents. There's literally 50 cent in US. What do you mean it doesn't exist? It exists. They do have 50 cent. No C4. I do have a C4 in the inbox. Let's drop a C4 here. Um, healing item, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. We've gotten some healing items. Let's get a, a a machete. Every time I would go buy groceries, I would go to your shop. Thank you. Soon, ladies and gentlemen. Soon, we're gonna check out the supermarket simulator. The ones are waiting. Ones are waiting. Yo, Nico! Nico, thanks for becoming a member. Thanks for joining the Cyric Town. As always, roads are not paved. No public transport. No health insurance. No hospitals. No nothing in this town. I am the mayor. And I'm glad to see you here. Welcome, Nico. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Thank you for joining. And we should get here, ladies and gentlemen, turkey. Let's get that turkey. Let's drop it in the chopper. Most of you have probably already noticed this, but the bigger zombies have now different animations, like the floater bloater. Toxic bombs and other dudes, they kind of run like big toddlers. So let's get the turkeys at least. Not too crazy, but whatever. Also, to the people out there, do you buy like whole chickens and do you like cook them? Because I find that very messy. Myself personally, no. That's it. Who buys whole chickens to deal with them? That's it. Thanks for coming to my mini TED talk. I'm gonna get the meat as well. I'll pop those juicy steaks. It's fine. We don't need another one. Let's open up one more chest and let's leave this base. Oh, more healing items. I mean, we already have like four racks. Like fully modded racks of food. So it's not like I absolutely need more. But I'll take it. Not go there. 
So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That was the raid. At least this raid was alright. Maybe not like a 10 out of 10 raid. But it was a nice raid nonetheless, in my humble opinion. Let's drop one hatchet here. Let's get more food. And let's bring all of this stuff back to the base, ladies and gents. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get out of here. Excuse me, Nico. Thank you for the super chat. <laughs> Thanks for being here once again. Are you nuts? Psych, did you get the caps slot machine from the previous event? Nope. For the cap slot machine, you had to have 15, like 10 to 15,000 caps. And I did not have that amount of caps, sadly. I had like only four and a half K, so I did not get that slot machine. It's fine. Maybe it'll come back next year. If it's out next year, then we'll maybe get it. If I have enough caps, maybe I'll start saving them up. And in a year, maybe I'll get 10k caps. Perhaps, maybe, I don't know. Some guy buys a stack of 20 chickens. I, I don't know. First of all, I wouldn't even know how to deal with uh, like a full chicken. Like, what will I do with it? How will I cook it? Like, it makes no sense. Doggos, eat! Carrick, did you get the caps slot machine from previous event? <laughs> event why did uh, Brian have to read it like that so yeah thanks once again Nico thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you for the support on the channel is not braining ladies and gentlemen the brain isn't braining the brain isn't braining okay it did brain a little bit i want to build the base like you is there a video for that no uh because you can just build whatever base you want if you want i can show you the base but it's just a base i'm pretty sure you could come up with a better base it's not a very well designed base in my opinion it's just a base have you ever roasted a full chicken nope chicken drumsticks and chicken breast that's it that's all i know how to do that's all i know how to prep anything else takes too much time and too messy in my opinion at least it's only Messi, not Ronaldo, am I right? <laughs> Guys, those jokes are dumb. Right? Those jokes are dumb. And I blame you for these jokes. Well, we've done five raids, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to have some ridiculous fun, you might be like. Cyric, what is ridiculous fun? Please let me know. I'm um, sad that we didn't get a new update in the in the supermarket simulator, but that's all right. How many ones do you have? I think two. No, I have three ones. I wish I could show my base. A fellow day one player. Is there any way to send your personal link off stream on Discord? You can send a DM on Discord. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the supermarket simulator, ladies and gentlemen. So let's do a couple of days here in the supermarket simulator. Let's grind just for a little bit. The business has to boom. And I can't wait, cannot wait for the next update. Maybe the next update will bring something new. Uh, so, uh, Juan number uno, the Juan number dos, tres. The, we have things to sell. We have a little bit of cash. As always, my motto is you start the day and you get cash. That's it. So we need to get big sushis. Let's buy the big sushis right now. 
uh, the large sushis. That's seven hundred dollars. Maybe I don't need that large sushi. There we go. Let's buy everything. I kind of already pre-purchased everything from there. Okay, these are large sushis. Let's store them here. What I need to do is buy more shelf storage here, ladies and gents. I'll buy more shelf storage. I'll be able to store items here, and then this dude Juan here will keep stocking those shelves on his own. I not made a mistake. I'm gonna get some zap soda. Okay, let's start storing that zap soda. Uh, zap soda will go here. Okay, the big sushis go. They're almost threw away these sushis, but these sushis are very expensive, ladies and gents. Can't throw them away. Okay, Pepsi will go here. The dude will just deal with the Pepsi. I don't need to do all of it myself, right? I'm paying for Juan, and I'll use Juan. Yo, Rave1357. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for the super chat, Rave. How do you think that they will bring all the extra storage back? Hey, do you think that they will bring all the extra storage back like the bar and other for those who missed out on them? Uh, the extra storage. Maybe. Maybe. I think when the warehouse came out and uh, the fridge one came out, I don't think you could buy those. I don't remember, but now you can. So maybe they will come back. Thanks, Rave. Thank, thank you. I believe that they will come out in some sort of an event. I don't know if you'll be able to get them for free, but maybe they'll bring them back in the store. I doubt that they'll bring that stuff for free, though. But maybe you'll be able to get that stuff in the store. Maybe. Again, I'm not sure, though. That's just a thought. Did they bring any storages in last generator already? Maybe that's too many T's. Maybe it's fine for now. Okay, the dude will restock the tea. And you couldn't find milk six pack. Okay, let's buy the milk six pack then real quick. Milk one, two, three. And let's quickly store it there. You can purchase warehouse and fridge in the store. You can purchase the warehouse and the fridge. I think you can still purchase those. But there are some other things that we didn't get. Like the bar. They haven't brought back the bar to the game. So maybe one day they'll bring it back. Perhaps. The store is massive. It's actually small. Okay, we got this, and we need now perhaps to buy some new things that I don't have yet. Like different types of meat. We don't have scallops. Okay, let's try to get the scallops. But yeah, will we ever get the bar? I don't have a slightest clue. I don't even remember how I got that bar in the first place. But yeah. Uh, moussaka. Uh, salmon. And scallops. Okay, that's a decent amount of things that I just bought. Let's get everything. I don't even know if all of that stuff will fit in the fridge. Okay, I'm gonna store this thing for now in 3.4. Okay, that's very cheap. That stuff is too cheap. Okay, I'll need to probably start uh, checking these dudes out because uh, there's a huge line. Okay, what are those? I don't even know. Salmon, probably. store a lot of salmon here so I'm just gonna give two lines for salmon 10.1 uh, how much does the game cost I don't remember 12 I guess is that the same salmon or is it different salmon okay I think it's the same salmon Norway salmon
Okay, moussaka. Let's store some moussaka. I've been eating a lot of salmon lately. Very pog. Saka for fourteen dollars, and more musaka. Okay, let's just give the three lines of musaka. Let's start those, and let's get the cash register. That's a lot of people. Not that many people, though. Okay, it's fine. I thought we need the thing, but it looks like it's fine. Maybe more customers are gonna walk in. I think more people are gonna walk in. And couldn't find Musaka. Just literally just added Musaka here. What are you talking about? So we're gonna add now this thing here. Have you had Musaka? I don't even have a slightest clue what is Musaka. Like for real, I don't have a slightest clue what's Musaka. So let's see what I don't have. Okay, their toilet paper again. They, they always complain about their toilet paper. They eat that toilet paper, I, I'm, I'm telling you guys. They eat this toilet paper. Should have bought more toilet paper and uh, stored more of it in the storage. Okay, there's a customer waiting for us. That's fine. Couldn't find pasta. Uh, okay. Okay, we don't have two types of pasta, so let's add it so that tomorrow in the morning I can buy that pasta right away. Pasta. Let's buy three bags of this. And what else do I have here? Three bags of those. Nice. And now let's check these dudes out. Beep, beep, beep. $32, sir. Thank you. You couldn't find bleach. That's fine. Couldn't find bleach. Oh, 60 cents. We'll take that. Musaka is made of eggplants. Lasagna Balkan's cousin is the best I can describe it. I have no idea. Can you hire someone to make orders of products for you? Nope. I don't think so. By I don't think so. I'm sure you cannot hire anybody. You can hire people to to take items from these shelves to restock. So you can hire restockers and uh, cashiers like your job is to buy items let's get some bleach so your goal here kind of like end goal is to get a bigger storage and just buying items and just dropping them here in the storage instead of restocking them and people will restock on his own on their own i think that's there's one more dude like buying something okay take your time sir that's fine. Musaka made with potato eggplant. Minced meat and eggs, my favorite food. I don't even know what is eggplant. I mean, I do know how eggplant looks, but I've never had any eggplants. I think that dude was just about to check out and I just stopped it accidentally. Cereal, sugar, flour. Cereal, sugar, flour. Uh, let's change the price of cereal, sugar, and flour. So cereal, ooh, it's now much more expensive cereal. Uh, sugar and flour. Sugar also changed the price, 6.4. And we can start the day. Some people say before you start the day, blah, 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 just restock and everything. It's kind of useless. You get more cash by just going. You level up a lot faster by just going. Because when you restock, you just look at the game and you look at how people come and beep out items. You might as well just do something when instead of looking at them. Okay, so let's buy some shampoo. Oh, I cannot buy anything else. Okay, let's buy these things and let's start restocking it. Then. Okay, I have this dude and the dude might work then. I did get some pasta. More pasta. Sadly, you can only take one box at a time. Would be very cool if you could take more than that. The 
That's it. The dude's gonna restock everything on his own now. So what else do I need? Large sushis. We still have some of them. Do a whole shelf of toilet paper. We should do more toilet paper because they do eat it. I'm telling you, they eat that toilet paper. I also need to buy some olive and olive oil. Olive and olive oil. Let's get that real quick. But more items are bought when you have everything available. That's just smart business. Have everything. That is true. That's also true. I'm just not really sure if it'll be if I'll get more money by them buying less but faster or them buying more but slower. Does that make sense? Okay, we've gotten some olive oil. The dude will do everything. I'm gonna hire another one. Oh, to hire another one, I need more shelves. Whatever, I'm just gonna buy another small rack. And I'll put it outside. Why can't it go there? There we go. We have another one. And I think I can buy one more shelf. Or maybe I'll just increase the size of this one. Uh, I stored pasta somewhere here-ish. ATP isn't enough. Just place a pallet on the floor and stack it to the ceiling. That would be a lot smarter, actually. At least we do profit on the toilet paper. Like, you get five eighty-four, Better than a dollar. Okay, so we have a thousand bucks. How about I go to the storage and expand the storage for 1,200? Now we have a door. Oh, Lord. Now we need to move some things around. Okay. Oh no, oh no, I just unlocked that one. Well, let's drop it here then. I'm sure it can fit. Alright, so... Okay, this is not gonna fit here, so how about I drop... ...this rack here. So let's start restocking the racks. I think that'll be a little bit smarter. We need more cash now, so I need to wait until the dude beeps out all of them. Couldn't find coffee, so we gotta buy some coffee as well. Also, to restock the entire store, I'll need to buy a lot of things, and I don't know if I have enough cash to restock everything. Now I'm gonna maybe move the computer even from this room here. Somewhere, I'll put the computer here. I'll be able to just buy items and see what things I have on the shelves. I won't really have to go here and look. Kinda. Put the big box in the stairs corner. This one? Oh. It does fit here. Beautiful. Is the freezer empty? Uh, I don't have anything to sell in the freezer yet. I didn't get a license. To sell something in the freezer, I need to get... Uh, where is it? A hot sauce, ketchup, butter, cheese. Where's... I saw... Pizza mixed. There we go. I'm pretty sure this one. I need to buy this license. Then I'll be able to start selling frozen pizzas. And other stuff. Okay, so no shampoo either. And how many items do we have in total? Wait, I need to quickly... Count, I guess. One, two, three... 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 3, 6, 39, 42, 43 items. 43? I oh, know, I lost the count. 4 per rack. So we need 10 racks at least. How many racks do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4 only. So I won't be able to store... All of the items on the racks. I don't have enough racks. I 
and to buy two more racks because why not? The upgrades come first. I haven't paid the bills yet. We could add some light in this room, but do we care? Oh no, I placed this thing incorrectly. No. There we go, now it's better. So ladies and gents, we are upgrading. Look at you working a computer on a computer. Uh, we have six. And that's it, we have only six shelves. That's not going to be enough for all the items. If I give one thing for one item in the storage. I guess. Well, as soon as the morning starts, I'm gonna buy a bunch of things. They almost don't buy milk. We have a lot of milk here. I think it depends. Sometimes they just buy everything, sometimes they don't. The more items you have, the... The, the less of those items they buy, kind of, maybe, I don't know. No sushi, no coffee. Well, whatever, the next day we have 800 bucks, so we're gonna try to restock at least as much as I can for those 800 bucks. We don't have uh, sugar. Sugar, coffee. Sugar, coffee, peanut butter. Let's add at least something here. Sugar. Coffee, peanut butter, and uh, how about hiring? There we go. I'll be able to hire another restocker tomorrow in the morning. That's what I'll do. Buy eggs. So do we... Okay, we're out of eggs and cheese. Let's also get eggs and cheese. Eggs and cheese. Okay, that's it. We're going to buy everything in the morning. Now, lots of work, ladies and gents. Shows the behind the scenes of making today's video picture. Today's one doesn't have a lot of behind the scenes. Uh, flour, sushi, candy, cereal. Flour, sushi, candy, cereal. Uh, flour, sushi, candy, cereal. Flour, sushi, candy, cereal. They need to... Th those price changes should be, like, here on the computer. Visible easier, because to see those prices, you need to go here and, like, search for these arrows. That's kind of annoying. And then customers com complain about the price. Flour, sushi, cereal. Flour, candy, sushi, cereal. Do I have any candy, though? Okay, we're out of candy as well. So let's buy all of this. Let's also get candy, because I don't have any. Wish we could also buy more than 10 things at a time. That'd be better. Let's hire another restocker. Juan, number... Dos, ladies and gentlemen, we have second one. Sushi stuff can cost $200. Yep, sushis are very expensive. So, where do I store things? I need to kind of... Start sorting it out. I guess. Like, for example, cheese. Cheese is going to be here at the end. At the bottom. But that'll be a lot of cheese. Cheese, coffee. Like, it's not gonna make any sense, will it? Cheese, coffee. Uh, okay, cheese goes there at the end. Okay, coffee goes here for now. I'm just gonna throw everything there. So, yeah, let's not start the day today. I could start the day and at least sell whatever I have there to get more cash. So, it would be better than just me staring at the screen anyways. It's not like I lose customers. Might as well just sell the rest of the stock instead of them selling everything. But, whatever. Maybe later. Okay, eggs, peanut butter, more eggs, more sugar. I store them in the same order as they are in the supermarket. That is smart. But am I smart? So they took all of the cheese. Whatever, let's store the eggs up there then. Do I have any more eggs? Nope. I have peanut butter. 
the dude took eggs. I don't even know where I store peanut butter. Let's store peanut butter here, maybe. That pasta's there, whatever. Peanut butter goes there, then. More coffee here. I don't know where I'll store the candy, whatever. Let's store candy with peanut butter. Because I definitely won't have enough space. Sugar up here. Sugar, candy, cheese, peanut butter. We need a lot of things. I need to bring the computer there. I think it'll be better. I'll move that computer later. Oh, it's on another side. Okay, that's not cool. Um, cheese. What else do I need? Cheese, candy, oil. I need everything. Like, I literally need to buy everything, little by little. We are running low on cash. Are you gonna do Bunker Bravo tomorrow? Is there the event? Maybe. Perhaps, perhaps. Dude, they restocked everything without me. Okay, here I'll store pasta. Up there I'll store the flour. Uh, sugar. How much space do I need for flour? Like two boxes or is two boxes enough? Maybe. Okay, stored sugar here. Oil will be next to flour. Cheese goes there. And that's it. Okay, that's not it. Cereal. Here at the bottom, whatever. Bread next to cereal. Pasta. They took it already. Sugar. There. Bread next to cereal, as I said. Dude, I'm gonna forget it. Where I store everything. More cheese. Let's get some bottled water. More cheese even. Tea, milk, eggs. Okay, we got those items. We need more. Peanut butter, flour, olive oil, salt, rice, pasta. Let's say we're out of cash. We need to start the day. They don't need to buy more milk. We already have a lot of milk. We can store milk near... Okay, that'll be oil. Let's put milk up there then. The store is messy. If it was less messy, it'd be easier to sort it out. Okay, so milk... Okay, I store milk up there. Coffee, I stored it here somewhere. Okay, there we go. Coffee's on the ground. Uh, water, let's say... Near milk. Makes no sense, but whatever. More coffee. Tea is gonna be near the coffee. More cheese. Buy each item and sort them one by one. I guess so. Juice, soda. Okay, that's it. We don't have any more cash. We need to start the day and they're gonna sort everything out. So everything that I got here, it's almost nothing. The storage is almost empty. Nuts. That's all I have to say. Just nuts. Each rack has eight. Uh, so here, I can buy everything. If I store only like... If I use one side of rack for two items... I 
think it can store more items that way. They're both liquid, yep. So whatever I have here, I need to buy this and then we need to buy more items. Food freezer in the storage room. Uh, it doesn't really disturb here the customers. They don't complain about it. From where you started, this looks amazing. I mean, we did progress a little bit. And still, this thing is almost empty now. I wish I could own a store IRL. I'm sure owning a store IRL is going to be more difficult than in the supermarket simulator, but... Yeah. If it was like in the supermarket simulator, then hell yeah, sign me up. We get here infinite customers, basically. Shower, flushy. <laughs> Sushi, flower, shower, sh mower. Put the freezer where the computer used to be. We should put that there, but I kind of want to get maybe more fridges there. And I think freezer one here, another freezer here. But yeah, for now we can move it. It's fine. They're in the corner with no light. Owning a store IRL is nothing like this. Customers talk back usually. Yes, indeed. Okay, that's it, Juan! Back to work! I do have too many items, like, for example, here I have an entire row of pasta, which is nice, but for them to fill it up, I need to buy a lot of pasta. I need to have a lot of pasta in the storage. Just a good and a bad thing. Okay, oil goes there. Salt. Salt near sugar. And I stole sugar here-ish. Where did I store sugar? Okay, sugar was here then, so I'm gonna store salt near sugar. Peanut butter was around here. I don't remember then now anymore. I go peanut butter was at the bottom. Rice is going to be near pasta. Pasta's here. So let's say flour was here then. Cereal here. Bread here. Okay, rice near bread. Flour. Rice. Peanut butter. Olive oil. Flour, two boxes, and more salt. Do we need to buy anything else? Cakes? Candies, yogurts, chocolate bars, cereal, there we go. Let's now sort these things out. Am I the only one lagging? I don't think it's lagging here. If it's lagging, I apologize, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry. But it shouldn't lag. From my side, it says that nothing's lagging. So we need to start storing cookies. The pasta here. So two different types of pasta. Cereal, two different types of cereal. Rice bread. Rice bread and cookies up there then? Why not? Go another type of stuff. Yogurts. I don't know where I'll store the yogurts yet. Let's not keep them there. The different type of cookies. There we go. Bon Papa and this thing. The candy. I stored candy somewhere. I think it was on the ground before. Well, I can store candy even higher. That's where the sweets will go. And chocolate. here and yogurts I'm still not sure where I'll store the yogurts not yet candy at the bottom I think it'll make more sense for now for the candy to be with the chocolate I need to buy another lamp here I don't see anything I know I'll have to pay look at this I'm not there so I don't care that they're without the light it's fine 
Okay, let's get the light here. I didn't mean to buy two of them. So let's get a spotlight and let's put it... There we go. Just so that I can see what's going on. Didn't mean to turn on the lights for them, but... Hey, that's alright. So where will I put the yogurts? The freezer stuff should be with the freezer shelf. That'd be easier to have an entire freezer shelf. Do I have anything from the fridge? Just milk and water. Maybe I'm going to remove milk and water and I'll move it somewhere else. Like, let's say... I had something else there. It doesn't matter. This entire shelf will be the fridge shelf. Oh, and also I have here yogurts. Why was I stored cheese with this? That makes no sense. Eggs, bread, not here. Okay, they stole my yogurts already. Cheese, eggs. Yogurt, there we go. How many Juans are we up to? Up to three Juans! We got three Juans in total now. I'll store the milk. Okay, the dude is now stuck. Okay, the dude is... L I made a mistake, ladies and gentlemen. I made a mistake. Okay, we have the few more customers. Two cashier, two stalkers. Also, we have four. I, I can't even count all of my employees. This dude doesn't do anything. And this guy over here, he's stuck, so... Last two thumbnail last two days your thumbnails have baited me into thinking your last day on earth thing. They're slapping so hard. I did play last on earth today. But at the end I play some supermarket simulator. So it's a last on earth thumbnail, but I do play supermarket at the end. So soda and salt, let's change the prices of soda and salt. Is the dude's still stuck? Oh my goodness, they're still stuck. What if I move the shelf? Are you better now? Goodness, there we go. Now the dude's better. So let's start another day because we need cash. Oh my goodness, you're back to being stuck! I need to, what, get that milk myself, but the milk is already full. Oh, I have boxes of chocolate. And candy. Why are you stuck? Finally, you're no longer stuck. At least not yet. Uh, so, anything else from the fridge? Sushis are very expensive. So, we need bleach, cleaners, dishwashers, shampoo, hand soaps. So, this... Oh my goodness, the dude is back to being stuck. Are you dumb? Are you stupid or dumb? Okay, so this row will be for the cleaning products, whatever. He's back to staring at that box, isn't he? Dude, I'm gonna fire you! I promise, I will fire you. Uh, uh, what an idiot. Take out the tag. I took it out. And I keep putting it back. Maybe I need to remove the yogurt tag. I don't know. So shampoo will go near with the... Whatever, here. Shampoo and the cleaner here. 
the hand soap will go with the shampoo. Dude, you must be kidding me. We'll fire you if you don't stop it. Okay, so we are out of meat. What else I haven't bought yet? I mean, we don't have any sushis and other stuff. Right, so let's go buy some of these. They are expensive, though. Oh, this is $700. I don't have that much. Cola price down. Cola price down. Oh, we need to change the cola price. Yes, indeed, sir. 2.8. I mean, actually, it went up. Everything's fine so far with cola. One is sniffing glue. He does look like that, doesn't he? We're out of juice. I also don't have any juice. So let's buy this. So sushis. Wait, this is the cleaner, the fridge stuff, milk, eggs. It uh, will be cheese, what, yogurts? Bread, okay, bread is not here for sure. Whatever, let's drop sushis then. Sushi, two different type of sushis. Big and small sushis. Meat goes up there. And the hand soap goes here. Okay, we're getting better, ladies and gentlemen. I guess now we don't have any juice. And the six pack milk. Okay, now we're gonna deal with sodas. There we go. Let's try to sort out these sodas first, then. So, flour. The top one doesn't make any sense. The water and milk. Where do I store milk? Okay, milk goes here. Water doesn't go there. Milk. Okay, this... This goes there. Okay, I think these items... can be moved uh, here then right the shampoo place milk somewhere else I should I think he stopped being stuck with that milk though Pepsi Okay, there we go. The juice, 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 juice. Orange juice and normal juice go there. The soda and normal soda, they go there. More... Okay, that's apple juice. That's cheap soda for the poor. It'll go up there. And that's the fridge item. I'll need another shelf for fridge stuff. Orange juice, more soda, and milk. I don't know where I'll store milk. I'll need one more shelf, so while it's not night yet, let's buy one more shelf. A small rack, actually, not a shelf. Change price salt. Change price salt. Okay, let's change the price of salt. Uh, 2.5. Thank you for letting me know. Maybe people will stop complaining that the salt is too expensive. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Milk, I'm not sure where I'll store that milk yet. And soda for the poor, it goes there. There we go. I got that huge rack here. So if this is the freezer stuff... Oh my goodness, he's gonna start staring at this milk again. Except now you're staring at something else. They messed up this entire rack. It has nothing good on it. So I'm going to store this rack here. And this will be the fridge rack in front of the other fridge rack. 
What are you looking at, homie? Oh my goodness, you're useless, Juan! You are useless! Did I tell you that? That you're useless. Okay, milk goes at the bottom. Oh, that's my computer. Whoops, I accidentally grabbed it. Why do you always put poor people food so high? You know, we can't jump. I mean, the poor people food is here. It's just the storage. But that's a good joke. You're losing money? No, I'm not. You don't lose money. In this game, you always get money. It's impossible to lose money in this game unless you pay the bills. Expect them to work with lights off. I actually do. Oh my goodness, that's it. So the shelves are empty, as empty as they get. Strike is making straight profit with them low people's food. Yep. Poor people's food is bringing a lot of profit. Okay, so we just gotta wait until these guys stop beeping. And now we just need to buy a lot more items. The fridges are restocking. Everything's restocking little by little. I'll need to buy flour, pasta. Bunch of flour, bunch of pasta. Instead of calling it soda for the poor, call it s uh, cheap soda, says DJ Ghost. It's a joke, homie. It is just a joke. Stop staring at this box! Why are you so... Obsessed with it. What is your problem with that box? Okay, that's it. We're done. So what did I earn? $300 profit. Apple juice and olive oil. Apple juice, olive oil. Ooh, that's pretty expensive. Olive oil and juice. Okay, so let's change this. Let's start the day. Because that way we'll get more cash. I'm gonna chuck this thing in the box. I don't! Too late, I chucked it in the box. Hopefully they won't complain. So... Pasta... Flour... Let's just buy those and let's start restocking. Pasta was with this pasta. Flour was here. Okay, we'll need now more oils. Maybe. You know what's more staring at one at the box and Psych not changing its place and expecting a different outcome. <laughs> what? I can't be bothered like Juan is stupid. Why is that my problem that he's stupid? <laughs> like I keep moving, I keep moving the tag, I keep removing the box, maybe he'll end glitch, I don't know. Stupid Juan. Uh, I don't have any water yet. Let's buy some water. Um, water near milk. Hell yeah. So what else do I need here? We don't have any bread, cereal, and rice. Bread, cereal, rice. Bread, cereal... And rise. There we go. Let's buy all of this and let's start restocking. Driving home, so now I can hear that the sound of birds is so loud in the store. It's funny. Hey, I'm glad that the... At least the game is not quiet. Like, you can still hear the birds. I'm glad that the game is not dead quiet. So that does get my approval. 
Also, eyes on the road. Be careful, god damn it. See, guys, I'm responsible. I give good advice to people. Uh, when we're gonna buy the next license? Oof! The next license is when the store here is full and when Juan stops being an idiot! <laughs> like, what am I supposed to do? Where am I gonna move that milk? It's supposed to be there. Stupid Juan. I can't even move this box anywhere on the ground. It's just there. I'm getting rid of this milk. Psych! No! Too late. Milk is gone. That's it. No more milk. Tea and more rice. So what do we need? Uh, candies and chocolates. Uh, buy a uh, license for frozen items. We should, but the, the, the storage is not storage yet. We need to deal with this first. Stupid Juan. Candy, candy was around here, so I don't remember where. There we go, that's where I store candy. Uh, chocolate. See, guys, I'm getting a little bit better. Probably not really. Uh, candy. Chocolate. And these items go there. So never. I mean, one day everything will be... Full. Filled. Yes. Everything will be full and filled and everybody will be fulfilled. Heck yeah. Let's buy more cereal. Um... Okay, we can only store two boxes of cereal. I got... A little bit too ambitious now. Okay, well, I'll put that cereal later then. When they eat it. Bought a bit too much cereal. That's alright. It doesn't expire. It's like doing a night shift working like a dog, yes? Well, that's 11 p.m. I just realized that. Okay, so let's do this day. And then I guess let's buckle up. Oh my goodness, we're out of flour. We're out of everything! How on earth do they keep buying all of this stuff? It's like, just restock during the day. Don't start the day. With what money? With what money, ladies and gentlemen? If I don't start the day, I'm not gonna have anything at all. Eggs, uh... Coffee. What I don't have there? Nothing. Like, the store is basically empty. I'm just gonna buy more flour pasta, but we just got it, but yes. One, two, three, one, two, three. Maybe I shouldn't be buying three of those. Flowers and pasta. Okay, the box has just exploded. Sorry, are you sure it's pasta in these boxes? I am pretty confident. Um, pasta... Pasta, flour. More flour. Did I just buy three boxes of flour of pasta? Yep, my bad. Should not have done that. Well, I'll keep the boxes here. I don't think he's gonna step on them. And cereal there, okay, I'll remember. Okay, it's 8 now. That's it, it's evening. Will I get to beep out a few customers at least? It's my turn to work just a little bit. Some shady stuff going in the stores. Like what, for example? Look at this! I kept buying boxes, like, for an entire day, and I still didn't fill out these racks at all. 
At least they have restocked everything. Look at this. The storage is getting restocked, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting more and more items. Like, I only don't have items here and here is so we're pretty good. Dude bought everything. You're feeding a family of 10 or something, homie? 162 euros. Thank you. And you're still complaining that you couldn't find steaks. It's fine. Could lose a bit of weight, sir. Imagine being a cashier and the cashier actually tells you these things. Uh, actually, I couldn't find meat. It's fine. You don't really look like you need meat anyways. That'd be a joke. Light in the storage. Sorry, it's balling. <laughs> Maybe you are right. Well, these customers keep coming in. Dude, do you know what time it is? And of course, go there. The, the, the Juan is just gonna stay in the corner. Juan, is everything okay? Wait, I wanna know if we can even zoom in on Juan. Juan? Are you alright, homie? I think Juan is fine. Two rows and two boxes in storage will last for a day and still have some left. Hopefully. They restock cheese, but wait, I don't have any eggs. Nope, zero eggs. That's it, both of these customers are done. I'm gonna wait until he restocks it because he will lose this box. So go on, I'm gonna see that he puts it back. Oh, more pasta. Here you go, and that's it, whatever. We'll, you'll deal with that box to, uh, the next day. That said, eggs, toilet paper, salmon. We do not have salmon anymore. Eggs, toilet paper. We don't have none of that. Eggs, toilet paper, and salmon. We don't have any of those items. In order to entertain you to police, I'm demanding that you sip some water and talk with us about the next Last on Earth update. I'm going to take a sip. And the next Last on Earth update will have helicopters. It will have... Uh, what else we will have? It will have everything. It'll have everything, everything. How much uh, do you want me to... Uh, how much do you want me to donate in order for you to do a try not to laugh challenge, says Loki. Loki, thank you for watching the live stream. You don't need to donate anything because I'm not going to be doing a try not to laugh challenge as I don't react to content. It is... Shady. That's as... Uh, much as I'll say. I guess. It's not my content. I didn't make that content. I would feel bad watching somebody else's content and laughing. And calling that content. I know some people do it. And that's perfectly fine. But I don't really do it myself. It takes two, three boxes per product to fill the shelf. Then two, four to fill the storage. Maybe time to reduce the shelves to half of each and add another section for toilet paper. Uh, probably. Maybe. But that will take a very long time to restock. However, if I restock this, this thing will last for a lot longer, I guess. Some of these items will be like this, but every time I'll get a new license now, I'll just give half of the shelf for those new items. You laughed at my paint picture once as insane. I'm sorry about that. I'll pay you the royalties and everything else for that painted picture. How much should I donate for the kitchen simulator in the cooking series to come true? Say a number, but no more than 20 pounds, and I don't get paid until 28th of April. Zero. You don't need to donate me everything. Thank you for... Don't need to donate anything. Thank you for watching the live streams. I'll maybe play that kitchen simulator for free. So, guys, I think I'll be wrapping it up. Thanks for being here. See you tomorrow. This way you can get more licenses without needing more shelves. Absolutely. I should, like, I'm, I'm not going to be using an entire row for another item. Especially when I have two of those restockers, they'll restock that shelf. But at that time when I didn't have the restockers, I thought that one row will be better because uh, one row will act as a buffer. 
You know what I mean? Because if I add like, let's say only one row, a tiny row of pasta, it disappears very quickly and I have to constantly restock it. But if I add one row, it's easier to manage it myself. But when I have these restockers, they'll deal with it themselves. So having only like two or three rows, little ones, is better. That's what I've done here with the fridge. I've done like half of this thing with big and then small sushis. Here we have, I don't even know, salmon and something else here, the moussakas. Here we got scallops. So, oh, I see what is moussaka. It's like a lasagna. YouTube police. Thank you for the super chat, YouTube police. The live stream is ending. It didn't have to drop the super chat now. Thank you, YouTube police. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The kitchen simulator. Oh my goodness, I have to check it out. Kitchen simulator. Is it a VR game even? Or is it a... Oh, I see the kitchen simulator. I know this game. I've seen the... I've seen it. It's like a restaurant simulator, no? No, it's not this one. Is it a restaurant simulator? I think it was Restaurant Simulator. Two rows of each, two products per shell. Yep, yep, yep. Kitchen Simulator, please. Kitchen Simulator. Thanks, YouTube Police. Thanks for the super chat. I can't find the Kitchen Simulator. There are a lot of Kitchen Simulators. There are lots of uh, different simulators. I dropped the link on Discord. I mean, I'll need to find a good one. Maybe we'll find like a game that's been uh, hidden under a rock. I'll find the, the better one. I'll find the, the hot one, the popular one. Where is it though? Can't find it. It'd be better if it's not a VR kitchen simulator because it'll be difficult to record that. Parappa the rapper. Who is that dude? Never heard of it. Yeah, I can't find that game that I was searching for. I only know the gas station simulator. I've been playing Last on Earth for a year now. Should I come back? Up to you if you feel like you want to play Last on Earth, you should play Last on Earth. Should be from Let Game It Out a Kitchen Simulator. Kitchen. Kitchen Simulator 2015. I literally can't, uh, let game it out, kitchen simulator. Is it even on Steam? I can't find it on Steam anymore. I don't see let game it out studio anymore. Well, I don't see that studio anymore. It looks like it's closed on Steam. Well, well, well. Look the link. This one says insane. Thanks, insane. Oh, then th I, I see this, but it's from Big Cheese Studio. 
Well, I'll check out then the cooking simulator. Perhaps one day. Can't promise anything. Because we never know. But maybe one day at the end of the live stream, we might check it out. So, thanks for joining. Thank you for the suggestions. Look at the chat play. Oxygen not included. Uh, perhaps one day. <laughs> Maybe I will check it out. In any case, thanks guys for being here. See you tomorrow. Thanks for all the suggestions. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for talking in the chat. See everybody. Thanks for everything. Shout out to all of you. And peace out guys. See you next time in the kitchen simulator. There's also the taxi sim simulator. I think that's a new one. So there's that. Take care. And peace out everybody. Take care. Take care.